so excited. If you recognize this corner, I just want to thank you. I am officially moving into my big girl home, which means I'm moving away from this corner. And this corner for the past year has meant the absolute world to me. Honestly, this corner has inspired so many creative ideas and given me so many life-changing opportunities all because of this little corner. I just want to thank you for sharing those memories with me because that means we shared it together. And I don't know why I'm just getting so sentimental over like a corner, but super excited for this big move, this huge change in my life but at the same time i am very grateful and blessed for everything that's come to fruition all in all i'm going to miss this little corner so dearly and i want to thank you all for your support and also thank you guys for listening to this very sappy intro but without further ado let's get along with the rest of the vlog this is so cute this is from revolve this is from camila coelho so cute Oh my gosh, this bag. I had a phase where I loved making these bags. It's so cute. I actually have a tutorial on my YouTube as well. So go check that out if you want to learn how to make a bag like this. This is so cute and soft. And I think this will be really nice for spring. So I might leave this out actually. You want to see a mini skirt? This is a mini skirt. It can barely cover my bum bum, but it's so cute. It's from Free People. I wore this to the Eros Tour concert. So pretty. I think it's just from Amazon. I wanted to go as like Midnight's. Midnight slash Fearless. Cause you know, she has like a Fearless dress. It's just like this with like tassels and it's gold. But I'm like, you know what? Let's celebrate Midnight's. So I got blue. I'm boiling some water so don't mind the noise. I'm just going to heat up some leftover salmon, broccoli, and I'm gonna do some of this beef bone broth. So if you follow me on social media, you already know that I already moved. So I'm making this voiceover and editing the clips after the move. Um, and it's mind boggling to me when I'm looking through this. I'm like, oh my goodness, I didn't even label the boxes with a Sharpie or just labels in general. I literally labeled it with a ballpoint pen. That is the most ineffective way to move. And number one, I'm not a frequent mover. This is my first time moving. Secondly, all the common sense just like went out of the window because it's like, why would you label your boxes with a ballpoint? pen anyway it worked out because i sort of like made mental checks of like where everything was and it just worked out that way but definitely if you're moving you need to label your boxes with a sharpie and with like a label printer or whatever you need to label them don't label it with a ballpoint pen like i did okay so we just picked up our keys and now we're gonna grab some breakfast vegetarian platter with just regular spring mix and I love fries so we're gonna have some fries really good choices here this is so cute This is pretty. These are okay. They're not bad. That one looks comfortable. It's got a contender. Okay, let's keep looking.
home with the package and it's from Victor Rolf. Their new Flower Bomb Tiger Lily perfume. And look at this card. It collects all the cards that I get. This is so pretty. So we have some prime and cheese sandwiches and some pizza. This smells so good by the way. I'm so excited. I'm so happy we're all done, but I'm just incredibly exhausted right now. I'm kind of hungry still, so I'm gonna get some more food. I'm just so happy we're finally done. And thank God for the movers. They were so efficient and fast. Okay, we are officially moved in. Our move took like four and a half hours. It's now like 5, 6 p.m. Everything is done. We've been making more trips. We have all of our boxes here and along the laundry store and in the other bedroom. We have like our coffee table. Um, I need this because I'm gonna tan later. Um, some PR and then just like some random like setups and stuff. So, oh my goodness. <laughs> another trip back home just to pick up some miscellaneous things that we need really random like a router water a bunch of like clothes hangers some boxes supplements seasoning which i just dropped all over the floor by the way into like a puddle but it's okay we're making progress i love these they're two for six should we get baked or original? I got these really cute slippers from the brand LPA from Revolve and they're just so comfy. They have a really nice cushion at the bottom so when you step on it, it feels like a cloud. It is officially the first morning here at my new place. It just feels surreal. First and foremost, like the movers got everything done yesterday within the span of like four hours. They were incredible, super professional. And I just can't believe that everything is moved out of my old place and into the new place now. I guess I didn't like mentally prepare for this moment. I guess it just all happened really fast, but I am super content and happy with where I am right now. I do have a lot to unpack and I have a lot coming up this week actually, but I got ready this morning, washed my face, did the whole routine, I got my makeup done and I'm about to make my first coffee. Okay, I woke up this morning and there was a literal spider like dangling over here. I'll like insert a clip. It was dangling. I'm like, wait, what do I do with it? Um, I just like let it go. It's just a baby spider, but I have just woken up. Like no glasses, no contacts, no nothing. Like I'm groggy. I turn on the lights and like it was right there. Anyway, I'm gonna go make my coffee now. This is gonna be my first coffee at my place and I'm very excited for this moment. Trusted coffee machine I've had for many years now. I think this was from Amazon, Korean art. I think that's how you pronounce it. And it's fast, reliable, and just very simple to use. I've also been loving this Kick and Horse organic whole bean. I've had a really tough time looking for good coffee beans. Either it gave like a weird aftertaste, or it's bitter, or it's fruity, or there was always just something wrong. But this was like the first coffee bean I came across two weeks ago that I actually liked. You know when you use an appliance for the first time and you don't really know the pressure like when you open it should i open all the way halfway a little bit this just like splattered because i just didn't know what the pressure was anyway okay 
Now, here's the fun part. I get to choose my coffee cup. I originally bought this cup for me to take with me to work because it's a tumbler. So it has a lid, it's non-spillable, and it'll keep your coffee or whatever beverage in here warm. But I ended up losing the lid, so now I just use it as a regular cup. But it'll keep my coffee much warmer than like a regular cup. It's basically a lose-win situation. First sip, back to the new place. It's so good. Why am I so dramatic? Honestly, it just feels very significant when you do things for the first time at like a new home or, yeah. So that's just how I feel and I can't help how I feel. I'm looking for my mirror, which I think I put in this box when I was packing and getting it over here. I just need to get ready this morning, so. Oh, perfect. I got this mirror from Costco. It's honestly the best. I saw someone selling this on Marketplace and I'm like, I would love to have two of these. Literally had this at my parents' place. And then I would think about it all the time whenever I got ready at my place. And then I finally went over, I got it. Even my parents were like, are you sure you want to get this mirror? Do you, don't you just want to leave it here so that whenever you come back, you can, you know, use it. I'm like, no, I really need it. And I can't find anything remotely nice and like at level because this has like a little bit of a height. Like here, it's not like one of those mirrors that just kind of like start like here, you know, like this. Anyway, really like this mirror. Saw two of them. Want to get both of them, but I think one will do for now. and like sandwiches for the movers yesterday but anyway i just got a turkey brie and turkey cranberry and brie wrap from choices 